thinking of her. makeup tutorial. I did my best with the products that I have. Most specifically, the star of this video, this is the Essence Palette, the Glow Must Go On. Since it has neutral or brown shades of highlighters or bronzers, which is perfect for Miranda's like us Filipinos. My inspiration was mainly to create a glass skin type or glass makeup tutorial, but I think I over bit because of the highlighter so that's it and of course the eyeshadows here it is the outcome so if you wanted to know more about this makeup look just keep on watching hello guys i'm already done doing my skincare routine and the most important thing that you have to do is putting a moisturizer on your face so mine i'll be using my all-time favorite the celetic hydration Next, I'll be using the Eye White Facial Cream as my base. On the first part, you'll see that my face is going to be so white. Ayan, magumukha kong snow white sa mukha ko dito. Pero okay lang yan kasi gagamit tayo ng foundation. Unti lang lalagay natin sa areas lang na kailangan. So I'll be using the Maybelline Dream Velvet and I'm in the shade 70. So I'll be using my fingers lang to warm the foundation on my face. Next, I'll be using the concealer, the Maybelline Age Rewind Concealer in the shade Medium. Ayan, I'll be putting it underneath my eyes and on the areas that I have to conceal, especially my dark spots, the blemishes, the pimple marks. So I'll be using a wet sponge here. I'll be using the Michigo Final Powder. I'll be using it to set the foundation and the concealer. Konti lang yung inilagay ko kasi i-achieve natin yung glow skin makeup. Ayan. So next is my eyebrows. So I'll be using the Essence Shape and Shadows Eye Contouring Palette. Ayan, I'll be using the darker shade and the medium shade. So, ayun, gamit na gamit na yung prime wax ko doon. Ayan. Tanan! Tapos na ang bilis, diba? So, ito yung tutorial niyan. I use the darker shade sa dulo ng aking brows and the medium shade sa middle ng aking brows. So, next is the eyeshadow. So, gamitin ko naman is yung lighter shade as a transition shade on my lids. Be careful not to be harsh sa yung shade kasi yan yung first step sa ating eyeshadow routine. So next is the Essence Touch Up to Go wherein andito yung aking shimmery shade. So, mostly ng mga shades na gagamitin ko dito ay may shiny, shimmering, splendid na mga formula. Ayan. I'll be putting it on the center of my face. So, I'll be using the Maybelline Concealer again para yung susunod kong color na ilalagay ay mag-pop up. So, syempre, yung color na gagamitin ko ay from BYS Metals, which is medyo peachy orangey yung shade. So, I'll be putting just a little bit of an amount on the center of my lips. Ayan. So, I'll be using the lightest shade, which is medyo may pagka-light pink. 
sa baba ng aking lips. So, nag-stop lang ako sa center nun. And, I'll be using the darker shade. Medyo may pagka-purple yung color niya or darker pink. Sa outer side, yung mga lips. Para mas magbigay ng depth dun sa aking eyeshadow. highlighter shade may pagka yellow tone I'll be putting it on the inner corners of my eye lids hanggang medyo dun sa top ng aking eyeshadow color sa so, una kong nilagay done na tayo sa ating eyeshadow so next is contouring So, ito, ginamit ko Essence Highlighter and Bronzer. Yung bronzer nila, medyo may pagka-shimmer and shimmer and shimmer na naman tayo. Ito yung kanyang tatlong shades. Kaya, yeah, apply ko para makita niyo yung color. There you go. Creamy yung kanyang consistency and hindi siya masyadong powdery. Para magbuka tayong magitisen at may shape pa rin ang ating mukha kahit glowy. So next, ko combine ko yung mauve color pati yung light pink color para ilagay sa aking apple of my cheeks as a blush. Next is nose contouring. Gagamit ko ulit yung lightest shade sa eyeshadow palette ng Essence. And I'll be using the BBL Cosmetics Fun Brush. Babalik ako dun sa aking highlighter palette. And nilalagay ko siya kung saan siya nilalagay ng mga beauty gurus kapag nag-highlight sila. Hindi ko na alam po nung tawag dun eh. Tatap ko may cheeks ba? and on my cupid's bow and underneath it. Optional lang din to guys. Pwede din kayo maglagay sa ilalim ng browses ninyo and sa top nun. Sa ilong ninyo as well. So, I'll be using a Demarionade Eyelash Curler. Pwede nyo na siyang initan gamit yung blower ninyo or ilagay nyo sa ilalim ng kilikili ninyo. And next, I'll be using my favorite Maybelline Lash Sensational para sa aking eyelashes. Itong mascara na to, maganda yung kanyang applicator since fit talaga siya doon sa pagle-lengthening ng ating eyelashes. Unlike any other mascara kasi, ito kasi may pagka-bend ng context sa kanyang applicator. So, next is my lips. I'll be using the Lip Eyes Sheer Color. Medyo may pagka-shimmer ulit. At huwag kayo magpapadisip sa kanyang color white. Kasi kapag in-apply nyo siya sa inyong lips, may pagka-light pink na shade siya. Yes, para siyang lip balm. Or lip balm talaga siya. May pagka-glossy effect. Kaya perfect dito sa glass skin makeup tutorial. And next is I use the 112 shade ng L'Oreal Infallible. Ito naman, yung finish niya, glossy. Pero mag-iiwan siya ng tint after nyo mag-hugas ng mukha or after nyo tanggalin yung makeup ninyo. Ayan. Madonna look na tayo. So, we're done.
Thank you guys for watching. Yay! And I hope you've learned something from this tutorial. If you wanted to tag me, just tag me on my Instagram or my Twitter account. Um, my Instagram is it's just SML. Or it is just linked down in the description box. I'll be waiting for you guys. So here's my inspirational glass makeup tutorial. Glass skin makeup tutorial or whatever. So see you guys on my next video. And don't forget, let all that you do be done with love. Ta-da! See ya!